If you're a nurse in the DC metro area and you're wondering what it would be like to go to work for another hospital, goodness knows there's a lot of hospitals to choose from in the DC metro area. As a nurse and as a recruiter, I'm going to give you some tips. Some of the things I think are important to ask, what does the nursing leadership look like? How long has that chief nursing officer been in place? If you're interested in a particular department or unit, how long has the leadership been in those roles? What does the turnover look like? As an example, I can tell you at the hospital that I work at, my chief nursing officer, I'm gonna say she grew up here. She started off as a patient care tech, became a manager, after she became a nurse, became a manager, a director, and now she's our chief nursing officer. That's the kind of hospital that you wanna think about when you go in and you ask the question, how many CNOs that they've had, and you hear a pregnant pause by the recruiter, you might wanna give thought about going there. Now I understand that a lot of recruiters are going to be telling you about all of the amazing benefits and all of the sign-on bonuses that they're going to give you. Then the next question I would ask is, how many travelers do you have in place? Sometimes when it seems too good to be true, it is too good to be true. Ask about staffing ratios. Of course, make sure you know what ratios should be before you ask the question. Nothing worse than walking into an interview and ask, how many, what's the patient to nurse ratio? And you don't know what it should be or what the standard is. So make sure you do a little bit of research yourself to make sure you're asking appropriate questions that you already know the answer to. As an example, if you're gonna interview in the ICU, we all know it's a one-to-one -one, or maybe it's a one-to-two and those are set by AACN guidelines. So don't be afraid to ask those types of questions, but I will tell you the culture, the feel for the organization, are they a magnet facility or are they going to tell you they're on the magnet journey? And if they've said they're on the magnet journey, how long have they been on that journey? Having a magnet recognized hospital means that you're one of the elite 8% in the entire world. I'm proud to say that my hospital is a magnet hospital. We're not on that journey. We are in it and we are magnet, which is amazing. And what does that mean to you? What does Magnet mean to you as a staff RN? It means that you have a seat at the table. That's another great question to ask. What type of a seat at the table do I have as a nurse? Is my voice heard? Do you have strong shared governance and councils that are both unit-based and hospital practice? Are you gonna be working night shift? Is there a night shift nursing council that you could be a part of? These are all things that are important in your career as a nurse. And as you're driving around the DC metro area and you're thinking about what you wanna look for in that next opportunity, or even if you want that next opportunity, think about things like turnover, senior leadership and their role and how long they've been there. Think about the team. Don't be afraid to ask the recruiter, what's the tenure? The recruiter should know all of these things. The recruiter should be able to understand and articulate what the shared governance looks like. They should be able to talk to you about the clinical unit-based and hospital-based professional practice councils. They definitely should know about magnet status. And if they happen to say that they're on the journey, again, don't be afraid to ask how long they've been on that journey. If you found those questions and my suggestions for when you're interviewing helpful, I would first of all love it if you would like and share and comment my information because my whole goal in life is to get out as much information to all of the nurses that are out there looking for their next opportunity. Now I can also actually get you a list of those questions. Just message me and I'm excited to share any of the information I have and even talk further.